listening and watching the famed jazz ensemble of Slippery Rock University as they appeared recently at the Berwick Area High School Auditorium. Featuring a very talented group of college-age musicians, the ensemble was brought in so current high school musicians in the greater Berwick area could experience one of the premier jazz groups in the state, if not the East Coast, up close and personal. Dr. Jason Cush is the director of the Slippery Rock University Jazz Ensemble. We are the Slippery Rock University Jazz Ensemble and we are into a five performance uh, performance tour. This is our fourth performance of, of which uh, we are coming from Slippery Rock University, performed in Pittsburgh, last night in Harrisburg, this morning Cumberland Valley High School, today in Berwick and tomorrow we're playing at uh, Queens College in New York City. So what you're telling me is you're very tired at this point. <laughs> We're enjoying ourselves thoroughly, actually. It's a great opportunity to play all this music, uh, music that was commissioned by the Slippery Rock University Jazz Ensemble and recorded on our next CD. And we will have uh, uh, the CD coming out in the fall of all this music. So then what, what's the purpose of, of, of the tour then? You're, you're trying to expose people to jazz or what? The purpose of the tour is to expose people to what we're doing at Slippery Rock University with the Jazz Ensemble. We take quite a bit of pride in, in this group at the university. Uh, they work very, very hard in this student project that we have, this commissioning of 10 new works and recording those. Uh, this, uh, really, really great project and we just want to expose that to many people as we can, let them know what we're doing at Slippery Rock and further the Slippery Rock name as much as possible. Also, gives our students the opportunity to experience life on the road, being in the bus, uh, playing in unfamiliar places, uh, staying in the hotels, and when we go to New York City tomorrow, our students will be able to go to jazz clubs and be able to hear jazz in its uh, authentic form. So, in essence, if you're planning on being a musician, this trip is going to show you what it's really like. That's right. This trip uh, is an example of what life on the road would be like if you were able to get a big band gig that's out on the road or traveling with a pop group that's uh, playing in different cities every night. This sort of mimics that for the students. And today in Berwick you're also going to be talking with the kids a little bit. And, and yeah, we're going to be doing a workshop with the students, trying to hopefully uh, help their jazz ensemble to increase its performance level and hopefully just spread the joy that we have for performing this music and uh, continue to learn every day with it. You're used to working with college kids, what's it like working with the high school kids? It's a totally different thing, uh, but I certainly enjoy working with the high school students. Uh, what's nice about working with college students, we have all music majors in our jazz ensemble, and so the level of performance, uh, the level of musical understanding is a little bit higher in general, but we hope that when we come and do an experience like this that we really inspire those high school students to, even if they don't take a uh, professional music path that they will uh, be more inspired to do more things with music and make it a part of their life permanently. Well, you have made music your life. What is it about music that just lights your fire? I don't know. It's an unexplainable thing. Um, I think it's something that's sort of programmed into our souls, whether you're a, a musical person or not. I think a lot of people like music, but there's a, another select group of people that have to do music for their career, whether it be teaching or music therapy or music performance. Um, Sometimes it's not not really a choice. It's been uh, it's more more or less been chosen for you than a choice that you've made consciously. An award-winning group, the Slippery Rock University Jazz Ensemble has performed at festivals, schools, colleges, and other venues throughout the United States, Canada, Europe, and Asia over the course of the last 40 years. And as Dr. Cush said, they made a stop in Berwick as part of their 2016 spring tour, which was working its way towards Queens College in New York City. Berwick Instrumental Music Director Ron Wasser explained the importance of being able to bring a high-quality jazz band like Slippery Rocks to the school. We have a long history with Slippery Rock. We've had, um, I think, approximately seven or eight students who have gone through the music program at Slippery Rock University, uh, and a number of them have played in this ensemble. And uh, they, as a, as a service to their students, they often take them into New York City to expose them to the real life of a, of a jazz performer in the city. And often when they do that, they'll do high school stops along their way. 
So this might be the third, third or fourth time we've actually had the group here in Berwick uh, over the 20 some odd years I've been here uh, to perform for the students. So they're going to do just a little clinic, a little uh, concert for the kids today, and then we'll do a little group to group clinic and uh, learn from some older, more experienced kids. What do you hope the kids from Berwick get out of this? The energy and the excitement of playing big band jazz at its best. Uh, this is a really exciting group. I'm sure whatever footage you use is going to be great for the audience. The Slippery Rock University Jazz Ensemble performed a number of original songs that will be included on their sixth full-length album due to be released sometime over the next few months. Now when finished with their concert, the musicians also took time to bring the high school students in attendance on stage with them to take part in a workshop designed to help them learn some of the finer points of playing a jazz piece. For, uh... 81 there, I need to have silence there, okay? Here we go, two, a one, two, 81. Shatter that glass back there with your tongue. <coughs> How familiar does that sound? Both laughing back there. Here we go, seven, three, two, one. Truly great group. To learn more about the Slippery Rock University Jazz Ensemble, log on to the university's website listed on your screen. That'll do it for this episode of Metro Casting, and as we leave, we will forego our normal theme music and let you enjoy a little bit more from the Slippery Rock University Jazz Ensemble. We'll see you after later.